Number 1. Always deliver more than expected. The user's satisfaction should be the driving force behind every product and service we create. Number 2. I think it's important to have a culture where people can try things and not be afraid to fail. Welcome to the INSPIRATIVE Quotes Chanel. Here I will tell you about the history and motivational words of a Google founder, namely Larry Page and Sergey Brin first. I will explain about history Larry Page. He is one of its co-founders and played a significant role in its creation and success. Google was actually founded by Larry Page and Sergey Brin. Here is the history and career of Larry Page. Early life and education. Lawrence, Larry, Page was born on March 26, 1973, in East Lansing, Michigan, USA. He grew up in a family of computer scientists, and his father, Carl Victor Page Sr., was a pioneer in computer science and artificial intelligence. This upbringing had a profound impact on Larry's interests and future career path. Larry Page attended the University of Michigan, where he earned a Bachelor of Science degree in computer engineering. He then pursued a Master of Science degree in Computer Science at Stanford University. It was during his time at Stanford that he met Sergey Brin, and together, they changed the course of the Internet's history. The Founding of Google In 1996, Larry Page and Sergey Brin, both PhD students at Stanford, collaborated on a research project that aimed to analyze and index the World Wide Web more effectively. Their objective was to develop a search engine that ranked web pages based on their relevance rather than simply counting the number of times a search term appeared on a page. Their work led to the development of the PageRank algorithm, named after Larry Page, which formed the foundation of Google's search engine. The algorithm used backlinks, hyperlinks from other websites, to determine the importance of web pages, revolutionizing the way search engines provided results. Incorporation of Google and Early Success In 1998, Larry Page and Sergey Brin incorporated Google as a private company in a friend's garage in Menlo Park, California. The name, Google, is a play on the mathematical term, Google, which represents the number 1 followed by 100 zeros, signifying the founder's mission to organize an immense amount of information available on the Internet. Google rapidly gained popularity due to its powerful search capabilities, user-friendly interface, and accurate search results. It quickly became the search engine of choice for Internet users and outperformed its competitors. Career and Leadership at Google Larry Page served as the CEO of Google from its inception until 2001, and then again from 2011 to 2015. As the CEO, he played a crucial role in the company's strategic direction and oversaw major developments and acquisitions that expanded Google's product portfolio and market presence. Under Larry Page's leadership, Google ventured beyond search into various other products and services, including Google Maps, Google News, Google Images, and Gmail. In 2006, Google acquired YouTube, which became the dominant video sharing platform globally. In 2015, 
Larry Page stepped down as the CEO of Google's parent company, Alphabet Inc., which was established in 2015 as a conglomerate overseeing various Google-related ventures and subsidiaries. He remained actively involved in Alphabet's activities as a board member and a controlling shareholder. Philanthropy and personal life Outside of his role in Google and Alphabet, Larry Page is also known for his philanthropic endeavors. Along with his wife, Lucy Southworth, he established the Carl Victor Page Memorial Foundation, which supports a wide range of charitable causes, including education, medical research, and technology. Despite being a prominent figure in the tech industry, Larry Page has maintained a relatively private personal life. He is known for his passion for technology, futuristic visions, and a desire to explore ambitious projects, such as the development of autonomous vehicles through Alphabet subsidiary Waymo. Please note that my knowledge is up to September 2021, and there might have been further developments in Larry Page's career beyond that date. Here are 10 quotes from Larry Page, co-founder of Google. Number 1. Always deliver more than expected. The user's satisfaction should be the driving force behind every product and service we create. Number 2. Innovation is not just about technology, it's about making people's lives better and solving real-world problems. Number 3. We should be focused on building the best products and experiences, not just competing with others. Number 4. Failure is not a bad thing. It's an opportunity to learn and grow. Number 5. If you're not doing something that is solving a real problem for people, then you're not working on something meaningful. Number 6. Great things happen when you take risks and challenge the status quo. Number 7. The most important thing is to have a great team, people who share your vision and are passionate about making it a reality. Number 8. Focus on the long term and don't be distracted by short-term gains. Number 9. Technology should adapt to people, not the other way around. Number 10. Dream big, and don't be afraid to pursue audacious goals. That's how you achieve greatness. Sergey Brin, he is one of its co-founders and played a crucial role in its creation and success. As mentioned earlier, Google was founded by Larry Page and Sergey Brin together. Here is the history and career of Sergey Brin. Early life and education. Sergey Mikhailovich Brin was born on August 21, 1973, in Moscow, Russia, during the Soviet era. His family emigrated to the United States in 1979 to escape religious persecution. His father is Jewish. Sergey grew up in Maryland and attended Eleanor Roosevelt High School. He pursued higher education at Stanford University, where he met Larry Page. Both Bryn and Page were pursuing their PhDs in computer science and began collaborating on research projects that led to the development of Google. The founding of Google 
In 1996, Sergey Brin and Larry Page collaborated on a research project at Stanford that focused on improving the way information was indexed and retrieved on the Internet. Their objective was to create a search engine that could deliver more relevant results by analyzing the relationships between websites. They developed the PageRank algorithm, which analyzed backlinks, hyperlinks from other websites, to determine the importance of web pages. This innovation formed the foundation of Google's search engine and revolutionized the way people found information online. In 1998, Brin and Page co-founded Google as a private company in a garage in Menlo Park, California. They initially worked under the name, Backrub, before renaming the company, Google, a play on the mathematical term, Google. This name represented their mission to organize an immense amount of information available on the Internet. Career and Leadership at Google Sergey Brin served as the President of Technology at Google during its early years and played a vital role in developing the company's infrastructure and search technology. As the co-founder, he was involved in setting the overall strategic direction of the company. Brin's technical expertise and focus on innovation were instrumental in shaping Google's culture and commitment to continuous improvement and technological advancement. Google's growth and expansion. Under the leadership of Larry Page and Sergey Brin, Google rapidly grew and expanded its product offerings beyond search. They introduced several services and platforms that became staples of the Internet, such as Google Maps, Google News, Google Images, Gmail, and more. In 2004, Google went public through an initial public offering, IPO, making both Brin and Page billionaires. The company's stock offering was a significant success, further cementing Google's position as a dominant player in the tech industry. Later career and transition. In 2011, Larry Page took over as CEO of Google, while Sergey Brin became the president of Alphabet Inc., a conglomerate established in 2015 to oversee various Google-related ventures and subsidiaries. Alphabet became Google's parent company, with Brin and Page serving as controlling shareholders. As president of Alphabet, Sergey Brin focused on exploring ambitious projects and moonshot initiatives through Google X now known as X Development LLC, an innovation lab within Alphabet. Some of the notable projects that emerged from Google X include the self-driving car project, Waymo, Google Glass, and Project Loon. In December 2019, both Sergey Brin and Larry Page stepped down from their executive roles at Alphabet with Sundar Pichai assuming the position of Alphabet CEO, in addition to his existing role as CEO of Google. Personal life and philanthropy. Sergey Brin is known for being a private individual who values his personal life. Like Larry Page, he is also involved in philanthropy through the Brin Wojcicki Foundation which supports various charitable causes, including education, human rights, and scientific research. Number 1. Solving big problems is easier than solving little problems. Number 2. I think it's important to have a culture where people can try things and not be afraid to fail.
Number 3. The perfect search engine would understand exactly what you mean and give you exactly what you want. Number 4. We have always tried to focus on the user. Number 5. We're at maybe 1% of what is possible. Despite the faster change, we're still moving slow relative to the opportunities we have. Number 6. If you're not doing some things that are crazy, then you're doing the wrong things. Number 7. We try to work on things that billions of people will use every day. Number 8. You always hear the phrase, money doesn't buy you happiness. But I always in the back of my mind figured a lot of money will buy you a little bit of happiness. But it's not really true. I got a new car because the old one's lease expired. Number 9. I think it's really important to have a feedback loop, where you're constantly thinking about what you've done and how you could be doing it better. Number 10. We want Google to be the third half of your brain. Okay friend, because this Chanel is very good for knowing both of our career history and giving motivation in living your life. So provide support and subscribe by clicking the like and subscribe buttons and leaving comments. Thank you.